Watch this video and learn how to draw a fried egg and bacon. Come on, kids, let's run, let's rush. Grab a pencil, chalk, or brush. Now let's go and make some art. Draw and paint, come on, let's start. Let's have fun, let's have a party. Making art with our friends. Party! Wow, wow. <laughs> Do you like to draw? Yeah. Do you love art? Oh, art is love. Yes. Art is love. Art. Art is love. Art. Good art day, art. Artie. Art. Hey there, Artie. Art. Are, Are you, you ready, ready to create, create some art? art? Yeah. Should we create some art? Let's get okay. going. <laughs> We're going to start by drawing the eyes for the fried egg. Draw two little black circles on the left side of the page. Very good. Now draw two larger circles around the small ones. That's great, Artie. How about a couple of eyebrows above the eyes? Mikey, this is so much fun. I told you, it'd be great. Now a nice smiley mouth with a tongue sticking out. Fill in the sides black. Little artists, if we're going too fast, here's a message from Louie. If Artie is drawing a little too quick, you can pause the video, that'll do the trick. While it's paused, you can draw away. And when you're caught up, you can just press play. Oh, that was marvellous, darling. Now, let's draw the eyes for the bacon. Do two small little circles on the right side of the page, a little bit higher than the egg's eyes. Then draw the circles around, like we did with the egg. And the right one. How about a smiley mouth for Mr. Bacon? Give him a tongue as well. And fill in the sides black. Now we have two little faces. Should we carry on? Let's draw the yolk inside the egg. We're just going to draw a circle all the way around the egg's face. You can do it in sections. Take your time and finish the circle all the way around. That's perfect. Now let's draw the white part of the egg around the yolk. Just do a wiggly, wiggly line all the way around. It's a lovely day to create some art. Sure is. Now let's draw the bottom part. Leave two little gaps. That's going to be for the arms. Let's do the left arm first. Two straight lines and a little hand on the end. Now in the gap on the right, let's do the other arm. Two straight lines and a little hand on the end. Should we give him some legs? Okay, a straight line down, a foot and a straight line up. It's that simple. Straight line down, straight line down and a little foot. <gasps> joke break. Okay, we'll take a break. Let's have a joke break. All right, so, what kind of car does a sheep drive? A Lamborghini. <laughs> Why is Miss Piggy such a bad driver? Because she's always hogging the road. <laughs> what kind of car does Yoda drive? A toy Yoda. Oh, I see Yoda from Star Wars. I get it. Let's get on with the bacon. We're going to draw a big wavy line on the left-hand side, but leave a gap for the bacon's arm. 
and a wavy line on the right side, but remember to leave that little gap for the arm. Now connect those two top lines. Draw a line across from the left to the right. All this art makes you work up an appetite. Well, I could sure eat some eggs and bacon, Betty. Me too. Well, maybe after we've finished, Artie, we'll go and make some eggs and bacon. Yay! Now let's connect the bottom. We'll go from the left across to the right. And now we have a piece of bacon. Let's add some legs, just like on the egg. Two lines down and a little foot on the end. Now let's draw some lines inside the bacon. Because sometimes bacon has little stripes inside of it. What's a stripe? Well, a stripe is a line that runs inside something. Let's do stripes all the way through the bacon. One, two, three. Here's number four. And let's do one more. Stripe number five. Artie loves stripes. <laughs> well, I love stripes too, Artie. Should we colour in? Colour in! Colour it in! Colour it in! Finished? Good job, Artie. I love how you did the yellow in the egg and the brown in the bacon. Artie, can't wait till tomorrow. Can't wait to see what you come up with. <laughs> well, little artists, it's time to say goodbye. Bye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.